Hey guys, we're here with the official Deadshot character breakdown from Netherrealm. Now, this was taken from a live stream, so if you see anything that seems a little off, remember that it's a work in progress. And don't forget to like and subscribe to keep up to date with all of our Injustice 2 coverage. Let's talk real quickly about what Deadshot is. Deadshot is the zoner zoner. He is the ultimate keep away projectile uh, defensive character. Okay. He is a just a master of projectiles. Um, of his special moves, how many of them are projectile zoning moves? All but one. Okay, very good. And the other one arguably uses his own body as a projectile. Okay, so, so, there we so go. There we go. could be five out of five. Now the thing is, Floyd Lawton does not miss, no, ever. He's the true. world's greatest sharpshooter, so it's very good to have a bunch of projectile moves if you if he's him. Good. If he's if, if he's him. <laughs> Steve nailed it. Steve using all the words today, <laughs> and some of them in the wrong order. Yeah. All right. So, so let's go ahead. Let's break so, him down. I think before we get into special moves, though, let's talk about his normal attacks. Because one thing I love about him is he uses guns so effectively. Even some of his normal attacks have guns. Like his jump too. It's, it's a really first. good advancing jump jump attack. This string ends in a gun, and you can actually hold it down. It's one two, and then. You can do a quick one to restand them, or you can go the whole way and get a good chunk of damage and a knockdown. His down one is a quick little poke. It's actually a, a shot, quick shot, a little quick shot. And then we can see his four three. There's a heavy kick there. Yeah, his four three does not involve. It is bullets. not no, but it involves his boot. <laughs> right. And I like his back three. It has a ton of range. Um, he does not really have uh, high damaging mix-ups, but he does have a low starter. That's awesome. It knocks you away. You can get a quick gunshot. Or you can miss the gunshot. And then he has an overhead. I thought he didn't miss. Uh, mm, yeah, well. It, it comes back and gets Gotcha, gotcha. Get him later. Get him later. He has an overhead, but he does not have a way to combo off this unless he uses a bar meter, and it's unsafe if blocked, so... He's kind of a uh, high-risk, uh, low-reward mix-up character. But then you get into his special moves. <laughs> Thanks for throwing a toilet at me. Thought it was necessary. We've always known that if Derek has the controller, he'll yes, just start pushing this is buttons. not That's a it. Superman interactable showcase, Derek. Felt like it was. So he has a wrist shot, which is an extremely fast projectile. It travels the full screen very, very quickly, and he can meter burn it to do multiple shots. And the cool thing about this move is you can hold forward to advance, or you can hold back to retreat. Awesome. So this can be used if you want to, let's say you're up close and you want to get away, you can retreat or you can use it up close, advance forward, and then do short little combos using advance forward. Then he has bullet barrage, which is instead of being a single shot, it's slower, but it's multiple shots. He's got to turn around and splash. Right. Like that, right. This one's flashing. And then the meter burn is a pretty decent chunk of damage. It's a barrage. It's a barrage. barrage it's bullets. literally a barrage. Now, if the wrist cannons aren't enough, he has a high-powered rifle on his back. Why have it if you're not going to use it, right? Which is actually a low shot. And then you meter burn it, and this is one of my favorite moves. Oh, mm. a, good, a, good, a good chunk of piece of damage to be able to do that. Yes. Now, the great thing about meter burn, burn, meter burn rifle is how good it is to keep the opponent away. So you're already, if they're already away, it's good. Now, let's say they're about here, and the opponent is blocking. Can you block? I can try. I've never seen All him right. do it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you really <laughs> All right. Please hold down. Okay. The opponent actually gets pushed away pretty far. So if you want to use a bar meter and make sure your opponent's not going to be close, you know, this is a move you can use to push them away. And then you can go back to using your faster zoning attacks. So then to really showcase his aim, he has Trick Shot, which is a shot that you can control. You can do a close one, a far one. And it's an anti-air. He can use it as a mix-up tool. He can use it as a keep-out tool. He can use it preventatively. You know, let's say the opponent's jumping in a lot. You can use it here. Oh. And then the meter burn one is very good. The meter burn one's great for as combo filler. And just totally, you can't jump when this is up. Like, this this part of the screen is totally blocked off. Yeah, it creates a wall. A wall, bullets. yeah. So then his one special move that's a melee attack is his assassin knee, which is an advancing, safe on block, special move. Toilet. He also has a toilet. He can meter burn it to get good damage and to knock you down for uh, wake up setups. Throw. People love 
throws. throws people love throws. Throws. throws are very cool. I will say when, when we have a new character that people are working on their desks, the first thing I ask them is, is the throw ready? Yeah, the, the same here. Because for me, the throw is the thing that like really it kind of sets off their personality. Like, yes. The throw, to me, is the thesis statement of how the character is. Yes. Sometimes. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. That's also one of the first things I'll ask a designer. Right. Ooh, the throw. <laughs> so Deadshot's pretty simple. You you basically, your game plan is going to be uh, shooting them, shooting them more, and then shooting them again. Right. What happens if shooting them doesn't work? Then you do... Shooting some more. Four, two, and shoot it. And then they go away and you do more shooting. Okay. So he's definitely going to appeal if you're if you're the kind of player that wants to stay back, keep them out, frustrate the opponent, make them make mistakes, and then punish them for the mistakes. Now, when people get in uh, on him, there's he can be a, a significant issue. Yeah, he's not helpless up close. Like I said, right. he, he does have the back one and the four, two mix-ups. But it's he certainly does not have, where you want to be. Right. It's not. He does have a good sweep. But it's, it's not where Deadshot excels. Right. And, you know, he, he does have uh, some decent combo damage in the corner. So he, he's not helpless, but it's it's not his ideal position. Like, if, you, if, you like, if you're someone who likes to do, like, super huge swag, swaggerific combos... He's probably not going to be your favorite character. Right. But if you just want to stay back and just kind of zone people out... Yeah, he's, he's definitely going to be your character. Absolutely. So let's talk about his character power. Character power. He it. has three different ammo types that you can load. First, he has incendiary bullets, and these will actually do extra damage, catch the opponent on fire, and do dot damage. So you can see, normally, you know, these only do just a little bit. They're mostly just a fast move to keep the opponent out. Once he gets this on, it's just real damage. Sure. So Second it even one, enhances his distance right. game. Yes, and, and this works on all the, even the normal attacks will do this, will get this effect. So then you can see he has explosive rounds which turn blue, and these actually knock the opponent back. So a move that previously just staggers them and gives you a little bit of breathing room will now actually knock the opponent down. And you can see, it gives you a lot of time. These duckable. Yeah, these are all high. And this is just the wrist cannon move. This is not the rifle move. And then the last one is poison rounds, which turns green. And this will actually drain the opponent's super mirror. So check out Superman super mirror. You can see he's actually losing a pretty good amount of meter. I just took a bar and a half of them. I would be so mad. Like, man. So the idea here is, you know, Deadshot's not the best character up close. And if you're afraid of a character, for example, Superman, who does a ton of damage using his uh, ice breath move, you can remove the ability for him to do the high damaging combos by keeping him away with the poison round. Right. And the cool thing is, once you start loading ammo, you'll see the bars draining. You can actually switch back and forth. You can so cycle it's, through the ammo You types. can cycle it through the ammo types. You're not just stuck with one. So you can use poison bullets, take a little bit of meter, then go to the explosive bullets. Now the opponent can't use, for example, his meter burn Superman punch to get in, right. and you can go to zoning him. So there's some definite, some, some, some mind games you can do Yeah, with there's some bullets. mind exactly. Now, some, I think you might have mentioned it, I don't know if everybody heard, the, uh, that's only wrist, only wrist bullets, right? Correct, it's only wrist cannon. So these do not, like, you can't add these to your right. Correct. Gotcha. Cool. Right. Let's do a super, huh? All right. I, I like this. I like the startup. Overhead? Yeah. Don't worry, he'll be fine. Yeah. He'll be what, okay. what I love, too, is like, keep him out, keep him out. I want to use my super. Got to get in. I forgot he also has an air wrist cannon. So even, even more air control. So he can really cut off every avenue. The opponent's gonna have to commit to a meter burn roll or a dash or an armored special move to try to get in. But you trap him in the corner and he might be having some issues. Yeah, exactly. Or will. <laughs> Excellent. So we got a couple loadouts. Let's, show some let's see some loadouts, huh? You don't have to change mine. It's okay. You always do the I always do that. Yeah, yeah. I know. It's your That's because I'm a professional and I want it to be right. A pro Fair professional. Enough. Look, it's in the book. <laughs> All right. So first off, I really like this gear. That's good looking gear. I like the color. I like the rifle. Mm -hmm. I like that his wrist cannons turn into almost like dragon mouths. Yeah. Yep. All right, so the first thing we gave him is his rocket boost, where he actually uses his rocket launcher on the ground and then jumps forward. Now, you can use this to gain distance quickly, and you can actually attack from it. Like, you can do a jump <laughs> attack and go into a jump I attack. I love that. See, now, you'll notice... We were some really fun combos with it yesterday. We were. Should we go for it? I think we should. You got something? It. Well, it, it took us a while, so we'll see. No! Come on, Steve. 
keep in mind, Steve is using the controller now, not me. <laughs> this is Steve. Steve. How many times will it take Steve to do this combo? Uh, forever. I'm, all right, one more try. Okay. You have three tries. Three tries. Three tries? Right. Three tries. Oh. That's a one. That's that counts. That counts. Yeah. That's that counts. You, would you count that if I did it? Yeah. 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 If I, absolutely. If I absolutely. whiffed a punch in the middle. If you just did the boost, we'd count. Yeah. It's true. We would. Fair. <laughs> fair. But fair. I think there was a part before the actual way three that we were two in last time. Right? Well, we're not. We're not showing that. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. All right. You're right. You're right. And you'll notice one of the fun things about the movie is a dead shot actually takes a little bit of damage for using. <laughs> <laughs> I, I did not notice that. that which means. Not. Which means. By the time the game comes out, till the end of this year, someone will accidentally kill themselves in tournament with Deadshot. That has to happen, right? Oh yeah, absolutely. I, I want, like, if somebody's playing online with somebody with gear move, yeah. I want to see that video. Yes. And it will be placed on top. It will probably pin that at the top of the uh, Justice game. Yeah, game. I, I want to see that. a stat that we track. Yeah. I do die from that. So this is a cool move to use if you want to cover more distance. Let's say you're fighting Dr. Fate, and his uh, projectiles are just as good as yours, and you're like, man, I really wish I had a way to get in close really quickly. There you go. There it is. So then, what if what if I told you he had even more air control? I wouldn't believe you, You wouldn't Steve. believe me? I, I, wouldn't I believe would, because you're kind of setting it up, well, obviously. Believe th what if I actually said, no, he doesn't? Well, then I would yeah. believe you as that, well. That'd be a weird setup. Air rifle Ooh. is, instead of going straight like this one, it'll go down. And the meter burn one is great. Oh! <laughs> Look how much damage. The cool thing is, is I haven't seen some of these yet, because I was you guys set this up while I was gone, right. and this is super cool. Yeah. Like doing the straight rifle into the air rifle to the straight rifle to it the air is rifle is so much super fun. fun. Yeah. This the sound effects are tremendous for these rifles. And we have one more loadout. He still does it. I'm doing that to spite you at this point. Fair enough, thank you. And this one's one of my favorites. This is uh, this is a shout out to our Injustice One players. Okay. You know there were a lot of Injustice One players that they loved the Keep Out game. It was one of oh, our favorite. That's parts, a good right? point. The, 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 the chat is saying something about damage right now. This is a fully loaded up Deadshot versus Super. This is a fully loaded up Deadshot with all Epic gear. Right. Right. And you did also say that like gear in a tournament, the gear of course the really moves aren't used in tournament. Right. That's right. right. So just okay. And also, I mean, just for you know, just say that. Hey, this build is not the brand new right. build. Yeah, right. so There's still everyone, things you're gonna see. They're gonna change and tweak. Calm down. You're at a ten. You need to be at a two. Everyone this is coming from Steve. Brown everyone back. relax. <laughs> so anyway, he lives at nine. <laughs> anyway, the, the the final ability we'd like to show is is a, a personal favorite of mine. Low shots. He's throwing Ooh. them bullets. Punching them. Low shots, dude. Oh, and uh, my favorite thing about this one as well is gauntlets are called bullet hoses, right? <laughs> <laughs> Dead shots, bullet hoses, low shots. So this replaces his low rifle, and you can see it is significantly faster. It's just as fast as a straight one, so the opponent has no choice but to be conditioned to sit there. And, you know, this is definitely going to improve his zoning. So you a little less damage, though. Yeah, that's right. You will get less damage and less pushback. At but the trade-off is this incredible speed of the low shots. Another trade-off, I would assume, and tell me if I'm right, can can you put your uh, character power on these? Yes, you can. So now they are character power as well because yes. those are So this will steal a, a lot of bar. Now, yep. this one is very powerful, but this is what this is one of the two-slot moves, which we right. talk about every week. That some of the more powerful ones are two slots. Right. Cool. So, I mean, the zoning machine becomes a, even stronger. Even stronger, right. That's awesome. Excellent. All right, so... What should we do next? I say we, I, and here's the deal. I, when I, when I, we were playing the stream mm -hmm. last week, I was like, well, maybe we do it on, maybe we do it on Friday. Mm -hmm. And Steve was like, oh, I can't, I won't be here.